Howdy, everyone! Sorry, I had to check a couple of things first. Oh, Yoda was first! First in! hey -o. Welcome, welcome! Hi, Knight! Yes, yes, I saw that he was already playing. Infectionary will probably start playing tomorrow, but he's going to be playing off stream because we're going to do that as together time in the evening. Hi, Telly! Hi, Taylor! Oh, all of the canvas flipping! I'm here for it! Hello, hello! No, I wasn't in his stream yet because I was checking and doing the updates because there was another patch update for Garden Witch Life, which is why I'm eager to get back into it because I want to see if they fixed my problem. I'm eager to know if we have discovered something new. No, really, really, really. I'm 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 not I'm not ducking his stream. I'm not ducking it. I'm gonna go check it out. I am incredibly excited for this. Oh, oh, you weren't being sarcastic. Okay, okay, cool, cool. All right, so without further ado. Okay, he's away from keyboard right now. Okay. All right, we're gonna pop in because I know everyone's got their own plans tonight, but I really wanted to see if they fixed the thing I was struggling with. Let me just make sure I load. Yep. Oh, oh, nope. I meant to load the earlier version of this. Okay. So let me. Can I do that here? Nope. Hold on. Let me reload from a different spot. Uh, let's go from here. I am fabulous. Really? It's not going to let me go from the other one? I want to go from here. There we go. Okay. Because I wanted to show you what it was I discovered on my lunch today. And I'm very, very excited about this find. So we'll, we'll get back to the mining thing in a second. But I was realizing I didn't explore quite as thoroughly behind my house after I got the golden tools as I probably should have. How are you doing, Taylor? Oh, did I did I start climbing? I didn't mean to climb up here. I got too excited, guys. I got too excited. I didn't mean to come over here. I wanted to go back to my house. I want to show you something that I discovered earlier, and I was just way too excited. I had to hop right back in. And I'm thinking it's part of the reason why I was struggling with the mines earlier was that maybe there was an area that was unexplored so between it and the patch release fingers crossed that oh and they did something cool for me if i hold down shift i can now run oh oh that is early oh hey we got mail something for you Hi! Thanks to you, I'm now in good company. Marianka and Pi are a good team, and together we have lots of fun. Pi suggested sending you something, so here you go. Hope you like it. Tin. Alright, so we see that there's not anything actually attached there, so that's still a thing. I had a pretty slow day. Actually, no, I had a pretty... I'm not, I actually, I think that's sort of a lie. We had an interesting day at work today. So my coworker on her way in today had like a seven week old kitten that was just underneath her vehicle. And as it turns out, oh, he's the doggy! We've got dogs! Oh, okay, okay, I'm on it. I am excited for Moonlight Peaks too. Thank you for sharing that with me. That is going to be so exciting. So if you remember, there's a couple of areas back here. There was this mountain up there, and then there was the little water cave, and then there was like that glade, right? 
Well, as it turns out, because I didn't realize when I got better tools that there was more to actually do up here. So, you know, you make the... I did, you know, do pass all the way up the, the hill because I'm crazy. But as it turns out, that's not the end goal. The end goal is right here. And before, you know, there's nothing that highlights to let you know that there's something to do there. But when I go after it with the axe, this disappears. Like, I can get rid of these thorns. Right? And then there's a whole new area I hadn't been in. I didn't check the store refresh. I have no idea what's in it. Okay, let's... Let me, oh, sorry, I'm, I'm missing. Let me scroll back. Yes, I'm very excited about the running. The running is now, like, my new favorite thing. Okay... Okay, yeah, yeah, okay, now I understand. I had to circle back on the conversation. Yes, I think that we probably enjoy a lot of similar games. You probably have a, a more open interest than I do, but we do share some, some definitely some similar styles that we like. I got the same weird ad on your stream was a Celsius energy drink stream huh okay <laughs> uh i don't have any control over what ones they put what which specific ads they use so i'm wondering if maybe they just use similar ones across like a time period like they pay twitch specifically and they just kind of oh i see a jumping thing in my future I love this area. It's, I mean, it's a mood like this. Can I just lay under here? Like, I would like to camp right here, please. Oh, oh, that makes sense. The ads are probably geographically locked. That would make sense. Ooh, so I can... No, they don't want me to cheat and go that way. They really do want you to deal with the thorns over here. Oh, and then there looks like there's more over there. All right, so let's let's deal with this. All right, and then let's come up here. Let's see what's going on up here. Ooh. Ooh, I see what looks like a harvestable item. Let's go back up the hill and check that out for a second. It is! It's a harvestable item. Well, that's because she's just so cozy and sweet herself. It makes sense that she introduces folks to cozy games. I would expect nothing less. I don't know if I want to try doing this little bit of a jumping thing right... Oh, no, no. I utterly fail at jumping. Oh, hey, there's more thorns to destroy. Is it a little crawly hidey hole? It's a little crawly hidey hole? Okay, let's see. Oh. I uh I got I got stabbed by a thorny thorn. Okay, so it looks like it was just another like another way to get to the same place cuz I think this is where I would have wound up ooh, earlier if I had kept going. Yeah, cuz those are the thorns I removed earlier right there. Little Witch in the Woods is on my wish list. It is on things I want to play. Oh, how fun. I can crawl and walk all over everything. Hey, uh, whoa. No, please don't tell me I'm going to be required to jump this stuff. Please, please no. Please no. Oh, <gasps> All right, you can't interact with them, but those are so cute. Well, you'll have to let me know how you like it, because that's definitely something I want to play. Berry flowers? 
Oh, it spawned a lot of them. Five. Yeah, they remind me of like the Will of the Wisps from Brave. Except for they don't seem to be leading me anywhere. They're just off enjoying their little spirit life. I'm kind of guessing maybe that they're fairies? Oh, is this a different spot? Yo, okay, that's where I crawled in through. Okay, so this is all just a continuous spot here. Oh. I'm loving the colors. There's not a lot of harvestables down here, though. trying, but I can't get close enough. Oh. Alright, maybe I'll try... Why is my axe not working? Okay, let's try it again. There we go. Yep, maybe I'm too close. Nope, that's not the answer. Okay. I'm not gonna... Not gonna... Oh, I don't have anything to eat. Oh, this is gonna be bad. Alright, so maybe I won't play with that. I'll just keep going around. I'll come back and clean that up more later. I can do what I need to do for now. Jump Crest Leaf. Well, I did say I was looking for harvestables. I wonder if by putting them in my hand, if it'll give me a recipe. Let's check. Alright. Nope. Nope. Nothing with those. Let's check this one real quick. Nope. Nothing with those. Okay. Continuing on. What's over here? Oof. This is a big tree. Uh, can I swim in this water too? What is going on over here? Maybe this is the backs up against that frozen area that I ran into earlier? Like, maybe it's... Oh, 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 you can get glitched inside of it. Oh, you just walk on the bottom of the water here. You do not swim. There's no swimming happening here. <laughs> Woo! Oh, the sound startled me. I all of a sudden swam when I hit that spot. I was no longer walking on the bottom of the water. That was very jarring. Okay, so we've effectively explored the water. All right, let's go ahead and actually do what we're meant to do here now, though. Oh, this is so pretty. Investigate. I'd gone up to this point, but I have no idea where we are or what we're doing now. But a lot of this... <laughs> nope, nope, that was... These look like the things that are in the, in the mine that I can't access or do anything with. I wonder if I maybe can break them. No, I can't break that one. We'll, we'll, we'll dig around all of them. 
Oh, night. Did you mean like the yippy sound I made because I got startled? You playing a horror game? Ah, that makes sense. That makes sense. I can see that. I'm not sure what is supposed to be happening here. Because none of these seem to be... I just don't look and interact with any of this. And I think I've almost made the circle. But I wonder if this is part of the mystery. Oh, yeah, like the Crimson Nirn Root, like in the underground area, has an especially like tinkly sound. All right, so I didn't experience anything touching any of the outer pillars. There doesn't seem to be anything to do with any of these on this part either. I'm wondering if I hit touch again, if it'll just send me back. Oh, strange voice. <gasps> no. Interloper. Rejected. Ouch. Ow. That, that hurts. Hey, right, where did it where did it where did it drop me? Oh this is the the thing for my basement. Oh and it's all friggin' dark in here now. I can't see. to the ground floor. Alright, I wonder if I can get back to that spot that way? Uh... I'm just gonna kind of refresh the area. Oh, hey! My health regenerated. So, I think they made it where, after a period, you start to regain some of your stuff back. Like your stamina and... Wait, did they make one of the ducks yellow? Did they change some of the ducks? Or does it just look that way because of the lighting? Did we get multicolors? Nope, it's still the same. I don't want to inspect the duck. I want to pet the duck. Ducky ducky. Ducky ducky. Okay, I'm done with that. I wonder if I can get back to the same exact spot, though. Like, let's try this again. I want to try and do it in reverse, and then I'll try doing it the way I did it the first time. So, it got me to my basement. My cellar. So let's go over to the next room. Enter cellar. Investigate. It's not doing anything anymore. Maybe I can ask Tin about it. Ah, so I did have to go back and interact with it again. Because that's probably what's going to prompt me to have a conversation with Tin about what the F is going on. Okay. Well, it's five in the morning for him, so he probably will not be awake. And since the last playthrough, I did experience a season change, and it appears I've got more pets. We've got moths! And when you pet them, they go to the grounds. Which is ridiculously cute. I keep waiting for them to drop feathers, and as yet, that hasn't happened. Alright, so while I'm waiting on tin, I'm going to see what is different about this area over here. <gasps> ducky, ducky. Yes. Yes. Uh, 
there are some really big moths in the world. Some of them are scary. I've seen a moth that was almost the size of my fist. <laughs> Duck. And go ahead and pick the seeds. I don't think we're going to see much in the way of a change in this area. Oh, we do have some mushrooms. Pebble mushrooms. Not what we need, though. We were looking for Amanita mushrooms. So why don't we... Oh, we'll go ahead and pick them. So nothing has changed over here. But let's, che let's check out our, like, glen area. The swampy area. Let's check that out. Let's see what's going on there. And that should be on the other side of my house. Oh, right. I keep forgetting that I can do this now. Sorry. <laughs> It's really awkward for me to hold down the shift in the W key. It's not really like, um, thoughtful positioning for my fingers. It's not comfortable. Oh, heck, it looks like we've got a lot of mushrooms. Mushrooms galore. That makes sense for Autumn. I'm wondering what they're going to be using. Oh, we've got new, new Florida pick. Autumn Spice Leaf. Let's create a stash of them. Alright, so we've got lots of new ingredients. Alright, let's, let's check some of this out. Pebble Mushroom. Oh, we already did that one. We know that there's not anything with that. Let's put you up here. Is that all of them? All right, let's check. All right, you can eat the mushroom. Holding that did nothing. Holding that did nothing. All right, so those don't do anything. Okay, let's see. What else can we find? Oh, what was that? Something glowed on the ground for a minute. What was it? Maybe it was just a trick of the light. No, I saw it. Oh, it's probably the lightning. I take it back. I get it. I get it. Okay. More mushrooms. Mellow fern. That one's not new. Let's see what's down here with the spooky tree. Well, the ground cover changed a little bit. That's not quite the same. Whoa, whoa, wait a minute, what happened? I didn't mean to go back home. I wasn't ready to go back home. Oh, and it respawns absolutely every time you come in there. I don't need to repick everything, I'm good. I've got plenty of mushrooms. Okay, so let's go in this direction and see what we can see. Woo! I slid. I'm in the mud! I doubt that the... Oh! Um, we can... We can... Oh, no, I still don't have cherries. The cherry trees haven't actually blossomed. I found cherry trees, but they don't actually produce fruit yet. So when they produce fruit, I'll be able to finally make the broom. Not that I understand what I need the broom for, but I'll have access to crafting the broom. Which shouldn't be exciting, considering I hate cleaning. <gasps> Thank you for feeding the dragon. 
I did decide to add that as an extension today as I was playing around because it was really slow at work today and the only thing I had to do was play with a cat. All right, so it looks like the only new things were this autumn spice leaf, which we got now a ton of, and the two new mushrooms. So I'm going to do myself. I loved playing with that cat all day. That was like the best day ever. All right, so we're done with this. We, we did see a change here. So there was something new. And it should be late enough in the day that I can go and talk to Tin. So I'm going to make my way up to the front. Oh, although this is in my way. You are in my walking path. Hi, you, out my walking path. And... When it's not raining, I'll do my compost. Well, let's go ahead and stick some of the resources away. I'm going to need to make another bin. I've got way too much stuff now. I need a better organizational system. I was trying to keep all the food stuff in the house and all the, all the decorating stuff inside the house. I wonder what the moth will drop. Like, the duck drops feathers. The cat and the dog and the bunny drop fur. But no idea what, what it's going to drop. Alright. Hello, Ting. How are you doing? Need anything else? Yes. So this part is still glitched where it shows all of the old previous dialogue options I had. Yeah, structures can be strange from time to time. All right, uh, I'm going to take issue with that. I work for the building department. Structures should not be weird from time to time. Structures should be relatively normal. Just throwing that one out there. So do all structures here teleport you to dark places full of stars and then back to your own basement? No, but I'm sure the best ones do. <laughs> hmm. That does sound unusual. Did you try turning it off and on again? <laughs> I think it's trolling me. It's trolling me. How do I turn off a structure? Yeah, that's what I want to know. How do you turn off a structure? I don't know. Remote diagnosis isn't always that easy. Can you tell me more about it? What did it look like? It was... Made out of a huge crystal, iridescent, shimmering in several colors. It was wild! Wild! I actually think I know what you're talking about. So you don't know what that was? Is it dangerous? Well, I'm not entirely sure. I've never had the time to actually take a closer look at those things. But don't worry. How bad can it be? They won't just erase reality, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. For some reason, I'm more worried now than I was before. So there are more of these things? Hmm, you know what? I'll take a look and make sure no reality will be harmed in the process. Okay? Okay. But aren't you way too busy? Oh, don't worry about it. I'll manage somehow. Also, it sounds like fun. I could really do with a change of pace. What if you get teleported to another dimension? Again, sounds like fun. <laughs> hey, don't worry. I've got my safety gloves. They're magic proof, so I should be fine. I want I want magic safety gloves. Wait two days while ten researches. Okay. Well let's see if Oral has anything new for us in the shop. 
let's see if there's anything new to to discover with our all of our little friends around here since it's still daytime oh hello what can i get you well let's go ahead and give you something uh something i have a lot of I'm just trying to split it a few times so that I still have a lot of it left. And then marry them back up again. Sharing is caring! Alright. Let's see. I'd like to buy something. Uh... Whoa! 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 Oh my goodness! Thank you so much, Taylor! What? That's so exciting! Oh, hey! Thank you! I wish I, I wouldn't have to get like a soundboard or something so I can do a separate, separate, like, nice thing. My little dragon is probably losing its mind. I've reached my goal! Now I gotta reset it to 15 so that way I can get a new animated emoji. Literally, we're on a brainwave. We're on a brainwave. I wonder if I can do that right now on stream. I don't think I can. I don't think I can do that right now. So I'll have to do that afterwards. But I will. I'll set it to 15. So I'm already so close. That is so exciting! Oh my goodness! <laughs> Love you. All right, hold on. I, my hubby would normally do this, and he's uh, he's asleep right now. So let's do. I think he set it to S O. I think that's what he did. I'll have to check with him later. But if not, everybody, please go follow Taylor. She is a sweetheart. I have to check to see what what my hubby said all my commands as i let him go nuts in there and now i don't know what anything is anymore oh blushing i am so red right now let's see what do we have all right so we didn't get anything new there okay do 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 oh right we can run faster now. We can run faster now. All right. Let's check out May. Let's check out our homegirl May and see what she is up to. What can I do for you? I have a gift for you. Let's let's give you the rose. <gasps> Oh my goodness, all right, so they have favorite gifts. They don't tell you that. They don't tell you they have favorite gifts. They don't tell you that at all. Oh my goodness, that's so cool. All right, so let's see. Let's see how that impacted the journal. So that gives you a sort of rundown of your of all of the characters in the world and your relationship with them and it moved the bar a lot guys all right so if you don't know may likes roses that makes sense considering it looks like she's got them you know in her hair because she's a cacti she's a blossoming cacti i love the commentary in here like as far as the way they describe the characters uh, there are some people who don't. There are some people who are not fans of roses. Infectionary is not a fan of roses. Yes, Hold on, I'll go back in so you can see it a little better. So, this is the Succulent Cafe. And it has, go around, a furnace. This is your oven. This is the oven that you have access to in the game. And you also, this is the only place to get access to a mixer. Ooh, 
Right? I love this. I want to cosplay her. She is so adorable. Why is it that all the characters I want to cosplay have different, like, wild skin colorations? I would love to sit there and read a book while baking. Like, this, like, well, I guess in theory, I guess you could because, you know, it's a cafe and there's places to sit. But I would definitely want to sit closer. Like, I'd want my table right where this pretty little flower area is. That is so awesome. All right. So we, we, we got, we became better acquainted with May. Let's see if maybe the patch did a thing where this is more, nope, this is still closed. Thank you for your interest in this fantastical establishment. Please allow us some more time for preparations. Be sure to grace us with your presence or your visit soon. All right. So that's not ready yet. And you still cannot jump on this. Like, it looks like you should be able to, but really, really, you can't. So should I visit the librarian or the spa and the doctor first? Who should I visit next? Well, we were just talking about cozy library, so let's let's check out Lyra. I love this magical walkway. Love it so much. All right, let's visit the library. We're going to the library. Oh, uh, hello. I have a gift for you. Let's see. Let's give Lyra... These are a lot easier to come by now, so I don't feel bad about... They still gave her too many slots. Like, you're not meant to give them this many things at a time. So that's still a thing. Alright, so that's not her favorite gift. I wonder what her favorite gift would have been. And you can't... I don't think you can gift more than once in a day, so I can't try with her again. But let's actually read her journal entry for a minute. Let's see. Let's see if it gives us any, you know, obviously she loves books. Like, we know this. She loves books. And this is... Lyra. She is 26. Reading, researching, role-playing, daydreaming. She sells books, recipes. Oh, oh, so eventually she'll sell me recipes? Is she gonna sell me books? Is she gonna be my book dealer? Is she my book dealer? Okay. All right. So we can't do anything new here. Yes, right? Like, she's got a- she has got a house that literally has a disappearing walkway. Like, mofos, you don't come visit me. I come visit you. Actually, I didn't think about it, but I wonder if the bottom half of that still doesn't do anything, like this walkway that spirals around her house. Let's see if I'm brave enough to run down in a corkscrew. So far, so good. I am so glad that this is a feature. I'm half tempted to switch over to the controller just to at some point provide better feedback on how well the controller aspect works. <laughs> no argument from me either. All right, so it doesn't look like anything new can happen down here. In a previous stream, I did um, break two crystals that were hanging out on this bottom row. So I imagine at some point that will have been part of a quest. I just... it let me destroy it, so I did, because I like to break things. That's me living my best life. Like, I love the idea of those escape rooms where you are just allowed to go in with a hammer and smash things for an hour. Like, the rage in me loves that so much. It's probably terrifying to behold me sitting there with like a hammer or a sledgehammer just literally going to town on broken furniture, but it is so satisfying. All right, so nothing new there. 
let's go and visit the doctor and our... I want to think of the building as like a medical spa because it's a spa and it's very zen. But we also, let's, oh, Lily's not out. But I wonder if I can visit Lily now. Can I visit Lily now before you could, oh, can I still steal honey from her? Holy feck. That's a lot of honey. That is a lot of honey. Ooh. You know what? We'll leave that for you. That's yours, bees. You earned it. Fair and square. All right, so you can't open her door. You can't break it down either. You know, just in case you ever want to try. It doesn't work. Facts. Okay, let's switch back to the fast running. Run up this hill. Let's go check on Nira and Luam. I'm actually not sure of the correct pronunciation of her of her name. I do hope when they do like the official release of this, they do like some phonetic spelling for some of the more unusual names. But this is the gender fluid character in the game. Let's go ahead and give her a gift. All right, nothing new there. Let's see what's going on over here with the doctor. Yes. All right. What would a doctor most want? Mushrooms? Oh, fairy dew is probably what I should have given Luam. Oh, do not eat the Aminata mushrooms. Ooh, dangerous. That's poison. Do you see that? Negative 5 energy, negative 10 health, and it gives you 5 slate. Oh. That, that's, that's kind of frightening. Alright, let's give her... Let's give her some mushroom. We'll go with that. I should have been experimenting with this from the outset, but I never believed that there'd be, like, a thing for, like, best gift. I did not expect that. I wonder if we can do more in her room now. Nope, nothing new in her room. Okay. I'll have to try giving her fairy dew tomorrow. Alright, and the only people I haven't spoken with is um, uh, Rudd, Brutal, the Beck, and his like teenage grumpy son. Because I can't go in that building and I can't get to their house either. So that that's that's a thing. That's okay. I'll get them later. We're gonna go back to the house and we're gonna sleep for two days because I don't want to wait out Tin's quest. I want to know what's gonna happen. Pit the duck. Pit the duck. Pit the duck. Ducky ducky. Ducky ducky. That's just so stinky. I'm wondering if running burns your stamina faster. It doesn't appear so. So that's good to know. Uh, none of that could be quick stored, so I'm gonna probably have to create a chest. Oh, I wonder if they fixed the thing with the yogurt being re as a required ingredient to make yogurt. Let's check it out real quick. Yep, you still need yogurt to make yogurt. That's unfortunate. And we're gonna sleep through a couple of days. So that way I can just go back and visit Tin. It occurs to me they probably were thinking of um, 
the female engineer that is shown in like Journey to Atlantis. Yogurt makes yogurt, but isn't but like cream that makes yogurt? Oh, hasn't been two days yet. Biscuits. Sleep just a little longer. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's... There's a couple... There's two recipes like that. The sourdough starter. You need a sourdough starter to make the sourdough starter. Like, that's kind of... It's weird. It's weird. Okay. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Let's go check back in on Tin. So there is also, as you can see off to the side here, an error with this, um, with this quest that it's showing all of the tasks I'd already completed related to this t uh, quest off to the left-hand side. Any news on the strange structures? Yes, this thing is so exciting! I've never seen anything like it. It's extremely complex, but elegant. It gave me quite the headache to wrap my brain around it, but once you get it, you get it. That sounds very complicated. To keep it short, I think it's a portal. Portal? To be precise, it's a network of portals. It seems to be incredibly old, older than everyone in this town combined. I, wait a minute, hold on. Rain check. The oldest person in this town is 26 and she's the librarian. Everybody else here is a tween. Right? No one here is old. Yeah, I haven't been able to retrieve much information yet since it's seen better times. It's quite cryptic in this state. Also, it looks like it locked itself after you accidentally used it. Whoops. Sorry. What you experienced last time must have been some kind of magical hiccup. But... Now comes the most exciting part. Ooh, 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 what's the exciting part? What's the exciting? Wait, tell me, tell me, tell me. I figured out how to stabilize it. Here, I made this portal key for you. <gasps> That's what's gonna make all of the things work. With this key, you can reactivate and use the portals whenever you want. The key also keeps a record of all the details, so if you ever need help, I'll know what to do. Thank you, Taylor. Have a wonderful day at work. Mwah. Love you. And it should be safe to use. Look at her dropping some adorable sunshine and then going about her merry day. Wait, what do you mean it should be safe to use? Well, no matter how much you plan, the world is full of mysteries and unforeseen events. But it should be safe enough. Again, this word should. This word should, guys. I'm getting I'm getting kind of anxious about this. Am I am I going to be spliced? Is this going to be a Ron Weasley situation? Be careful though. The spells I used on this key might have side effects on similar structures. Ooh. Okay. All right, is it a key, is it a key in my inventory? Doesn't appear. So, I'm guessing it's just something that I'm carrying around in my person. All right, let's check the journal entry. Find an alternate use for the key. Use the key on the teleporter. Ask Tim, like, it, it gave, it's showing all three tasks in a row related to this quest. So it's giving me sort of spoilers. So find an alternate use for the key. All right, let's go ahead and go into the mines now, because that sounds like what we're supposed to do with that. Touch. Woot! 
Okay, so that did something. And I've been told that I'm supposed to look for vents to interact with. And that there might be one back here. But it doesn't look like it. So we're we're gonna we're we're gonna give it a minute. We'll we'll hang out in here for a second and try and find vents. Like those silver doors is what we're looking to interact with. But in previous game through playthroughs situations, I've only been able to get it to bug out or do a fatal error or existentially do nothing. <gasps> it worked! It worked! Something is happening! The water is draining! Oh my god! The... Ah! Winner, 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 winner! I'm so happy. Oh my gosh. I wonder if it has something to do with the polluted river in the town. I am I am so excited about this, guys. I am needlessly excited. This this stinking mine has been killing me. Let's continue. Let let's let's get the job done. Technically, I, I I opened a lot of this stuff while swimming around when it accidentally let me go places I shouldn't have. So, that's a thing. And this is technically the one I guess I just did, but I'm just gonna double check, make sure there's nothing else to do. There's not. Okay. So I'm looking for another silver... Yes! Progress! Progress! I am so happy about the progress. This... this was literally keeping me awake at night. I am easily perturbed. Let's see what we got. Alright, so this leads me back to my mountain area behind my house. So I'm looking for another door that is near and touching water. I'm guessing I probably want to stay on these footpaths. So I'm gonna strategically fall because I'm lazy. Yes, they've been working really hard on this. Like, absolutely ace to them. They've been really, really working. And they've been, their Discord has been like insane with people fixing and coming in on things like, hey, here's my, my save data. These are the things that are going wrong. I st How do I get over there? Uh, okay. Okay. Yes. Yes. I love the Discord server for this game. Ooh. What's going on? I did swim through this area, so I know that I've already emptied this chest. And I dumped planks in there because I ran out of inventory space. Hey, snacks for later, snacks for later. Yes, yes. And there's a lot of love for this game in the Discord server. Like, it's a really great community. I don't see me leaving it anytime soon. And now I'm kind of curious about like what other games that might be coming out with. Let's try this again. And even the other members, if it's more of just an you know, an issue where maybe you're not sure what you're supposed to be doing, they can help you figure it out. Oh, that looks like what I'm supposed to be going for, but let me, let me finish going through this walkway. So they clearly wanted me to do this. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep. It's beta for a reason. They're, they're, they're working out kinks. 
so that way they can release a game that is as great as humanly possible. And I appreciate that so much. All right, so maybe I wasn't supposed to come over here yet. Where did where was that shining thing in the ground? Do I really want to nose dive that far? I don't think I want to nose dive that far. I got to remember where it was I saw it still kind of hanging out in the water. Where did I see it? I think I saw it around here someplace. Yeah, there it is. Swim! Because there's nothing else around here. There's That's the only thing I could have done. So let's activate it. Yes. Yes. So with, um, with a lot of the characters for Dreamlight Valley, even when you get to level 10, it's not when you get to level 10 that you usually get the item. It's usually after you complete their level 10 friendship quest. And that was confusing for me at first, too. The water's draining, guys! It's still going, it's going, it's going, going, going. I actually didn't wind up with too much trouble with that, but by that point I was already stockpiling resources. So I had a ton of, like, so that's the one where she needed, like, you had to grind out a lot of, um, what was it? You had to grind out a lot of iron, I think it was. Like, I remember there was one resource you needed, like, 200 of. All right, this looks promising. Where is it leading me? We're going on an adventure. Ooh. Yeah, the iron, especially if you didn't already have unlocked all of the areas that give iron, then you would have only had so many uh, resource areas to spawn from. Oh, I'm using the wrong thing. That's why it's not working. You could always use a little more stone. Ever since I learned I could decorate the rest of the area in this game, I like the idea of having a ton of stone. There is a lot of stone. I'm not totally sure where I'm supposed to be going towards. There's a lot of area. Oh, all right. That's promising. It goes up. Okay. All right. We're doing things. We're doing things. We're getting places. We're going up, up, up. We're going up, up, up. Please don't fall. Uh... Did I not see the last one? Was I not supposed to go all the way back up again? Was I supposed to stay down in the water? Should I jump for it? That was a long fall. There we go. That was the last one. And I think that's where the poison bubble was. You know, I'm gonna stay over here just so I've got a reference for how much water is being drained away. So I disabled my original, um, like, alerts that I had designed because I thought the dragon was cuter, but let me know if the other way was better because I was just kind of experimenting with it. I named my dragon Ezzy. 
and their companion is named Cece. Like Cece, my spider hat. This is so much water. Where is this water draining to? I'm pretty sure this is the source of the pollution. Because it's got rainbow guts. Ancient battery. It looks like a honeycomb, but made out of crystals. I'm sure Tin will be excited to see this. I think there's a similar structure at the gate. Oh, I bet that once I move that, I'll be able to teleport between all these lights. So now I gotta find a way all the way back up to the top. Freaking heck. Alright, well, I see glowing to the close to the ground over here, which means there's gonna be a mining area. What? There's still more water that could be drained? Because I can't actually, like... Oh, they made it where it drops crystal shards and the, the chunks. Before, when you first upgraded and you hit them, it only gave you the, the chunks. Uh-oh. I don't think that's the way up. I think this is a dead end. Alright, so that's not it. But I wonder if I can just Geronimo out of here. Geronimo! Can I fit through there? Nope, that's not a thing. Okay. Can't fit through there either. Okay. Got a little stuck. Alright, so that, that was a bust. That's not the direction we need to go in. Let's keep looking. It makes me wonder if there's one more, like, water draining area. I need a walkway. I don't want to swim aimlessly forever. Like, there's- I'm sure there's gotta be, like, a way to get back up. There's no way they actually intended for you to use the reset player location to get back up to the top. But I will. I will this time. But that, that can't be like what the way you're, what you're supposed to actually do. So let's go show Tin this artifact. Please be awake, Tin. I know it's at like 10 o'clock at night. I wonder if your house is open though. Probably not, cause it's, it's really late. It's really late. 20, 0, 2200. 2300 oh it's 11 p.m they are not awake yeah no all right let's go sell some planks since i inexplicably now have like a hundred planks and i probably have an overabundance of some of these other resources too so we can go ahead and sell some of those and we'll switch to using the running so the dragon is cute cool all right, I'll keep the dragon for the time being. Like there's a way to use channel points to feed it and then you could um, breed the dragon. Uh, there was some other stuff that you could do with it too. If you get your own dragon, then you can do battles with my dragon. We're gonna split this in half and sell half of this because I don't think I need quite that many. I definitely don't need that. I don't know how I feel about poisonous mushrooms, so that can go too. There we go. Yeah, let's merge some of that together. That's some extra. I don't think I need two stacks of everything. I think that's good. That's, that's respectable. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Sorry. I wonder if you can dig in the sand yet. 
that's been a thing that they couldn't fix before to actually get sand nope still can't get sand that way duly noted Yeah, I went playing around with all the different kinds of extensions you could get. And I was like, this one looks cool. It's quirky, but adorable. It kind of felt on brand. Ducky! And the weird rock thingy is back. I wonder if it's still glitched. It let me pick it up and put it in my inventory for all of like three seconds at a time. Pick up. Actually, let's test that theory. Let's move, let's empty a pocket space out. Pick up! Mm, creature rocky and it shows the mushroom, so that part is still bugged. But uh, it's evidently not meant to like perpetually. Oops, see, this is what happens when you let the flowers grow too long like this then it just becomes lavender seeds instead of lavender flowers and then the plant disappears so you always want to you know pick your lavender as soon as it blossoms so you don't have to start over on the growing cycle So while I've got it right here, let's go ahead and put the lavender seed back into the ground. One there. Ooh. Let's do one here, one there, one there. Kind of fill the space in a little bit. There we go. Bit the chickity chick. Oh, he's so cute! I love the animals in this game. They are so adorable. Alright. Go to sleepity sleep so that we can wake up and find Tin. Alright, Tinny. Tin should be awake. I like the little soft background music that's inside the house. All right, moths would not be out at this hour, I'm just saying. It's too early. Oh, nope, that one just made a white square. Duckity duck. Duckity duck. Duckity duck. It's just, it doesn't leave that spot. It's my greeting duck. Telly, I have a greeting duck. I have a greeting duck, I think, at nearly every little bridge. <laughs> I can't wait until I can make some cob bricks so I can actually give these duckies a little duck pond. But I have to get sand and clay, and I haven't been able to locate those resources yet. Wait, but I did find another artifact. Is it gonna make me do this first? All right, so this is gonna go through all of this again. We did this dialogue option already. Ah, I would love that. You are my good morning duck. Hmm. Well, we'll go ahead and give him a gift, but I'm getting kind of aggravated that I can't Oh, what would he actually, or what would she actually like? You know what, she'd probably like... Let's, these resources were kind of expensive, so I only want to give her one. But I bet she would really like that. Not bad. Dang it. Really thought that they would like that. I've... Oh, ancient battery empty. I should probably charge it. I have a feeling I know what I'm supposed to do with that, but it doesn't tell you that that's what you're supposed to do. And it won't let you use these because those are from the previous dialogue options. Uh, let's see. 
let's see. Is there anything new in here? Nope, nothing new in there. You can be my good morning duck, and I'll be your good morning sunshine. Does that sound fair? Alright, so I think what I was looking for with this was the mountain. And I think that is... Oh, hey, we got feathers. Oh, we got lots of little resources. I still have no idea what to use some of this stuff for, because I just don't seem to get a lot of recipes. But Telly, I have so many ducks. I have so many ducks. Like I said, a duck at every bridge. Let's see. Don't need to pick any of this stuff right now, but I'm just trying to get to my frosted area. Really? I have to do all of this part again? Okay. There was a huge boulder here originally. I didn't really need rocks though, so I didn't want to ore it and then have it take up space in my pocket. I do have like a suggestion for them here. Like it, like it clearly you're supposed to do something with this key, right? And it looks like it fits in here, but it doesn't tell you that you need to do this before you talk to him. And that is a little bit... a little bit annoying that some of these don't have enough guidance. Like, I don't need them to hold my hand, but I do want them to be, like, very clear about what it is they're wanting me to, to accomplish, because otherwise I would sit there and be spamming tin over and over again, like, take my thing, it's right here. Why don't you want it? Like, I would, I would, like, you know, a certain kind of personality would be very upset by that. Yeah, just a little. I mean, it doesn't need a lot. Just, just something small, like, maybe it needs to be energized. You don't even have to say where or any of that, just, like, some sort of indicator that there's a step between one thing and the next. Would, and I would be happy with that. While we're waiting on that to charge, let's go ahead and lay down some compost. So I can get more grass. So, let's pull out some stuff. I've got plenty of oregano leaves. Those can be made into... in clover, too. I still don't know why some of these have stars. And a couple of them have like gold, have like black and white stars. So I've been trying to keep those kind of separated. Okay, we've got plenty of you. Let's take some of this for the pile, some of that for the pile. Leave that alone. That's fine. Okay. Let's go make some stuff. Hi, Stepbread! Oh my goodness! How very cool! Thank you! Thank you for the cheer! Oh wow, so cool! Yes, uh, Taylor was kind enough to pop in earlier and she was gifting subs, so she was probably because you were one of my last visiting peeps yesterday. So yeah, thanks Telly. Thanks Telly and Taylor, because I wouldn't have Taylor without Telly. Like, it's a whole daisy chain. Thank you guys. Oh, love this community. Love you guys. Mwah! <laughs> Oh, I got so excited, and now I don't even remember what it was I was doing. Alright, I don't want, I don't want to dump those in there. I got plenty of oregano flowers. I can put those in the composts. Okay. So let's pull out our compost stuff. 
Aww. You guys are so sweet. And some mad love goes out to my husband, too, because I wouldn't have any of this community if it were not for him being so active in it himself. So props to the hubby for having such amazing friends. I do not want to sell that. I don't have a lot of that. Oop, I didn't mean to do that. There we go. Okay, let's... Let's do it that way. And it'll take it a day, but it's going to turn all of that stuff into compost material. And shift W. Ooh. Oh no, because I let it grow. All of this stuff over here is going to, when I pick it, it's going to disappear. I'm going to have oreg new oregano seeds all over again. That's okay. The duck really likes hanging out in this oregano, though. <laughs> oh, I got nettle. There we go. Yeah, he is a winner. I couldn't have asked for a better hubby. All right, so... Oh, man, I don't need to plant 99 oregano. That's a lot of oregano. Who's going to use all of that? All right, well, I guess it's a farm. You know what? We'll farm it. That's what it'll be. We're going to farm the crap out of oregano, guys. So much oregano. Oh, I didn't mean to put it so close to that. Whoops. That's okay. I'm making myself dizzy. Why is there so much oregano? Uh, you know what? Yeah, I can I can let him out of the naughty corner. I can let him out of the naughty corner this time. And because I've planted all of this over here, I'm going to extend this area, my, my green area, out a little bit along my house let's see is there i've got two different compost bins let's see if there's anything in my other compost bin oh yes mad compost we'll go ahead and we'll set some of this to compost now too i don't really need all of those seeds those can be fine those are fine on their own they can be composted all right, so should I do green up more of the front of my house or more towards the back? What do you think? The front or the back? I guess I could finish like fixing up where I've lost some greenery here in the front. You do have to recompost every once in a while. So I can do the areas that have lost their brilliancy. Oh, frick, that got tall. That's the end of its life cycle. Maybe the back? All right, let's go to the back. Although I will just touch up where I've got some holes here. All right, let's go to the back. With my immense oregano field. <laughs> Alright, so we'll start kind of working a little bit here. And a little over here. 
All right, so we've, we've, we've used up that bit. Let's go ahead and scythe this down. These things still hurt you when you, like, run into them. They cause you to lose health. I'll leave the grass. The grass can stay. Alright, let's go ahead and sleep off the day, because I really, really want to go check on the battery and continue on this merry quest. So let's go to our mountain. Let's go to our snowy mountain. All right. And our snowy mountain is to the back. I really should do a separate walkway over to the lake. I didn't do that originally because I didn't want to get confused with it not being an actionable area because there's nowhere to explore after you go there. You know what? Not on my walkway. Not on my frickin' walkway, guys. No. You can go on either side of it, but not on it. Like, don't do this to me. This isn't the mountain I meant to go to. That's the other mountain. I needed the other mountain. It's, it's bad when there's that many mountains that you can lose track in your head of which one you need. I like that the dog looks like a corgi. too just like a real corgi so a friend of mine they have an instagram account wiggle butt walter and their dog is the most adorable dog ever wiggle butt walter is life he's just so happy Okay, yeah, this is the area I needed. Oh, no, too narrow of an area. I don't think I can go in through there. Sweet. We're going on an adventure. We're going on an adventure. Yeah, I'll take those lavender seeds. Give me your seeds! Okay. I wonder if it would be like a an exact 24-hour spacing for this battery charge. Or if it's literally just the next calendar day. Take charged battery. Okay, put you up here. Again with the stars. I wonder what the stars mean. I'm gonna have to ask in Discord what the stars mean. It probably means at some point it'll be for a quest, but then if that's the case, why are some starred and some aren't? Are there grades? Is there like quality to these herbs? I mean, I guess that would make sense. That would that exists as a thing in real life you know, quality control on things. Maybe they were, oh, maybe one means that it was planted in like composted soil. Maybe one means that it was done in fertilizer. I should try selling them and see what the values of them are as far as like the difference. I should do that. Add that to my to-do list. Along with putting more compost out here. Chickity chick chick. Chickity chine the Chinese chicken. You had a drumstick. Oh man. Why am I thinking about the bare naked ladies? Bare naked ladies. Ducky ducky. So I can't leave this area without petting the duck. I just can't do it. Requires duck petting. Hey, Tan! Any news? Ah, uh, 
block. It's the same thing over again. Alright, so it didn't update the dialogue option. Uh, use the key on the teleporter. Okay. So, I guess I should have just gone back to my house. I inadvertently made a trip into town for no reason. <sighs> okay. Okay. Hey, Telly, do you have a favorite kind of ice cream? probably move this so that way it's more in line with where the camera is. I'm gonna need to get like a special prop for holding. What's your favorite flavor? I'm starting to plan out my my painting, the, the ice cream painting stream, so I want suggestions. I needs the inspiration. Enter the cellar. Muse. No way. What? Wait, does that mean I can select it? Home, the fairy forest. What's this? What? Buy while you online shop banana ice cream and cookies and cream and rainbow. Is the rainbow like the, the, we call it Superman ice cream, where it's like red, yellow, and blue? Or is it literally like every color in the rainbow? Congrats on arriving early. Ooh, rejected. Well, you came back just in time for the, 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 the story update. So you got impeccable timing. We used the teleporter and we have been rejected and rerouted. What the what? This looks like Sleeping Beauty's castle. This feels like a heartless situation. Where am I? And why does it look like the Forgotten Lands? And where can I jump into this water? Can I jump into this smoky water? I bet I can jump into this smoky water. I love the way this looks. Can I destroy things? Can I destroy things? Nope, I can't destroy that. Alright, fine. Alright, I can't break things, evidently. Well, let's try over here. Ooh, that looks like I can break it. I like to breaky breaky. Nope. It's just there for mood. Okay. All right, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll, I'll raise you your mood rocks. I really want to fall. It works. The battery looks charged now. I wonder if I can use it on the large gate in the mine. Nah, girl, I'm busy. We're, we're going to hang out here for a little bit. I want to know what's going on. And why it looks so freaking weird. All right, we're falling. Wee! Geronimo! Oh, that's anticlimactic. Is there a separate map just for this area? All right, so that's still wrong. It believes I am in the mine. I chose this over here. I am not in a mine. And moreover, how do I get over there? Like, these are not connected in any way. I wonder if those are walkable. Like, if I, I wonder if it's like the, the library, if I walk towards it. Nope. We're just going to fall. We'll let it do its thing. Wait a minute. What? That's kind of disappointing. It gave me, it brought me to a whole new world and I can't do anything in it. 
fine. All right, it wants me to go to the mine. Maybe it means I'm meant to come back here later. All right. Oh, can I break this stuff? Nope. All right, let's use the teleporter. Whee! Yes, that would make sense. All right, so home, the fairy forest. That's clearly where they want me to go. But it wasn't letting me select that. It let me come back here. Let's try it again. So it wouldn't let me actually select the mine. So we'll go back home. We'll go back home. And we'll walk to the mine. I thought I was going to be able to just teleport there. Nope. Evidently there are limits. Ah. How dare they. What? I- oh wait. Ducky. Ducky, ducky, ducky. Ducky, ducky! Ducky, ducky! It makes me think of the Tuki Tuki from Jungle to Jungle. Tuki Tuki! Yes. Teleporter, absolute game changer. There is evidently a limit to how much you can use the, the shift and run thing. That would be my hope, too. That, that you'd be able to do... This should be the last one. No. No, 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 Do not bug out. Do not bug out. No. Oh, okay. It's completely frozen. And I can't escape out. But I can roll over the stuff and it tells me what's in there. Oh, man. It's okay. It's okay. All right. I'll just have to clo I'll have to hard close it. And I'll reload it. It's okay. It's okay, game. We'll figure it out together. We got this. Yup, it's just in beta. It's expected to have issues. We'll give them the grace. Things happen. I mean, even games that get released occasionally glitch and freeze like that. So, you know, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna hate. All right, so I think that would be the most recent one. Nope, that's not the most recent one. No, that's definitely not the most recent one. That's not it. Please let the autosave have been better captured. Oh, no, I lost the whole thing. All right, that's, that's what I get for not saving. That's what I get for not saving. Okay, let me just, yeah, that really is the most recent one. You know what? I'm a little bit discouraged at this point, guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and, and end stream because I'm gonna have to catch back up on all of that, and I'm not in the mood for that right now. I made a lot of progress, but it's okay. We, we've made a lot of discoveries, and now it's gonna be faster when I go to do it the next time, so I'm not gonna let it, I'm not gonna let it, like, weigh me. I'm not gonna think about it too hard. I'm gonna go eat some dinner and spend some time with the hubby. And then I'll come back and catch up to where I was. Aw, thank you. Thank you so very much, guys. Do you guys have any suggestions on who to raid out to? I don't, I can't see who's all online at the moment. Let's see. Let's see who is available. Who is online? Who are we going to visit? Let's see. 
I know that somebody is playing Final Fantasy. Origin of Hero. All right, we're going to raid into Origin of Hero. Raid. Origin of Hero. Start raid. Okay. I am so grateful for everybody coming in and 